Dr. Gray, how are you today? I hope you are happy and fine, okay? Well, so today is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday? Thursday. Thursday, October, November or August? August. August, the 30th of August, yes? Okay, so remember today you have to hand in the three minutes video. Hoy tocó entregar eso, yes? Uh, this uh, every holiday, last holiday, next summer holiday, and the questions, the final questions, are you going to, are you going to, usando objetos, que estaba muy buena la actividad, porque de paso te divertís un poco, yes, okay, good, well, so, today we are going to work, yes, on pages, pages 128, 129, 130, yes, from the class book, yes, is it clear? Good. So we are going to talk about New Year, yes, and celebrations, yes, celebrations. Okay. ¿Qué son celebrations? Celebraciones. Celebraciones, fiestas, yes, okay. Okay, mucha atención, yes, okay. Sí, también vamos a hablar de, eh, yo te iba a decir, no te quiero dar pistas. Yes, okay? Ya habrás visto en el libro seguro, okay? So pay attention, we have New Year, repetition. New Year. New Year. New Year. ¿Qué sería New Year? Año Nuevo. Año Nuevo. Friendship Day. Día del Amigo. Día del Amigo, de la Amistad, Friendship Day. Okay. Good. And um, the Book Day. Yes. Yes, okay? The World The World Book Day. El día del libro. libro. Three celebrations, ¿ok? Are you ready? Yes. Para eso nosotros preparamos algo con la teacher, Nicole. Yes, ¿ok? So, pay attention now. Oh, this is not the one. Pam, 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 pam. There we are. New Year in different parts of the world, yes? ¿Cómo celebramos Año Nuevo en diferentes partes del mundo? No. No. Ahí se ve mejor, yes? Is it clear? Bueno, yes, voy a borrar lo que escribí. New Year, Friendship Day, 128, 129, and 130 from the book, okay? ¿Miraron las correcciones de la prueba? Yes? Tienen que abrir, eso ya se mandó la clase pasada, ¿yes? Tienen que abrir su file y mirar cada uno su corrección porque ahí le hicimos todas las anotaciones. ¿Es it clear? ¿Yes? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Ok, good. Voy a tratar de agrandar. I will turn off the lights. Yes. Entonces, ¿qué vamos a, a ver en esto hoy? ¿Cómo festeja cada lugar? Celebrations in different parts of the world. world. Yes, ok. Good, yo te acerco más a vos, ahí. Yes, is it clear? Good, good, good. Ready. Argentinian people, Argentinian people love celebrations. New Year's Eve, New Year's Eve is popularly called, ¿cómo se llama New Year? Año? Nuevo. Año Nuevo. On this day, ¿qué hacen las families? They, on this day, yes, families and Close friends, ¿qué tienen juntos? Have lunch, have dinner, have dinner, have dinner together, yes? Okay. And what do they eat? ¿Qué comen? ¿Qué comen vos? What do you eat in, uh, at, in New Year's Eve? Meat. Meat. Pizza. Barbecue. Pizza. Um, en otros lugares también pueden comer turkey, pavo también. Bueno, eso es en, en acción de gracias, ¿sí? Okay. What else? Different sopa paraguaya, empanadas. And what do you drink? Champagne, cider. ¿Qué es cider? 
See? Yeah. Draft. Cider, champagne, coke, different drinks. And what do you wear in New Year? Red or white? White. White, a white dress, white outfits. Yes, okay, it's very beautiful. White sandals. Yes, and in Christmas, at Christmas? Yeah. Red. You wear red, yes? Vieron en las revistas. Like Santa. Yes? Like Santa. Like Santa, yes? Entonces nosotros copiamos los outfits y nos hacemos las divinas. Okay? Good. At midnight, ¿qué pasa en la medianoche? Everyone has a big toast. What is toast? Chin chin. That is toast. Brindis. Yes? Un brindis, yes? A big toast. And it's pan dulce. Yes? Mm, delicious. An Italian sweet cake, because pan dulce is from Italy, that has dry fruit, que tiene, se, eh, puede ser, puede tener chocolate or fruits. Yes? Que depende de que más te guste. Fireworks, subran los que me interesa. Fireworks are thrown. ¿Qué son los fireworks? Fuegos artificiales. Fuegos artificiales. Are thrown until the next morning with people dancing, and people dance, sing, yes, drink, celebrate the whole night. This is in Argentina. Yes? Okay? Good. Vamos al otro de lado. A ver qué hace la gente en Denmark, en Dinamarca. In Denmark, yes, during New Year's Eve, people throw all plates. Miren lo que tiran. ¿Qué son all plates? Platos. platos viejos, old plates and glasses, vasos y platos viejos, yes? They throw old plates and glasses against the door, yes? The door. Yes, okay, good. Of family and friends, ¿sí? Va y le tira a la casa de tu amigo, le tira un vaso viejo, yes? A glass, ¿qué más? Platos viejos, ¿sí? A uh, family of friends to banish bad spirits. Para empatar que los bad spirits. Yes? Los malos espíritus. Pero no crean que le van a espantar a, uh, a un zombie. No. Los malos espíritus son las personas mala onda. Yes? The negative, negative feelings, negative thoughts. Yes? Is it clear? Yes or no? Ok. No vayas a imaginarte que van a la casa y espantan los muertos que hay ahí. Los zombies. No. Bad spirits se refiere a se refiere a que ellos tienen esa creencia, esa creencia y que espantan los que los bad spirits, los malos sentimientos, los negative thoughts. Acuérdate que los negative thoughts, ¿qué pasa? Son feos, ¿ves? Como dicen las palabras. Más vale tirar todas las, ¿sí? Platos, glasses, ok. They also uh, stand on chairs. ¿Qué quiere decir stand on chairs? Se paran sobre sillas. Sillas, stand on chairs and jump off of uh, them together at midnight. They believe, ¿qué hacen? This is the chair. Se paran todos juntos. Yes, and they jump on the chair. Yes, okay. At midnight. They believe cree, that this action will give them good luck. ¿Qué le va a dar? Buena Esto, suerte. Buena suerte, ¿sí? Entonces, eso es lo que hacen en Denmark. Está divertido, la verdad. Sí. Siempre uno tiene platos viejos y vasos viejos y, bueno, para espantar los negative feelings, ¿sí? Yeah? It's, it's nice, ¿sí? Yeah? Ok, ojo con el tema de stand on a chair, porque por ahí te podés... You can fell off the chair. Ok. An onion, esta es otra tradición. An onion is traditionally... ¿Se acuerdan de las películas de los vampires? ¿Qué se le ponía a los vampiros? Ajo, no onion. Pero a algunos que no les gusta el ajo ponen onion, ¿sí? Yeah? Para que espantan los vampiros, que no existen, ¿sí? Yeah? Okay. An onion is tradition. I was very afraid of vampires. Sabían que yo tenía gran miedo a los vampiros cuando era chica. Yeah. Oh my God! But vampires don't exist. Okay. Well, an onion is traditionally hung on the front of doors. ¿Sí? ¿Dónde, dónde cuelgan esto? Front door of homes. En la puerta. Sí, en la puerta delantera de la casa. Yes. Okay. In Greece, esto es en Grecia, eh? as a symbol of rebirth in the new year. Como un símbolo de renacimiento, como que renaces. Viste que uno dice año nuevo, vida nueva, bueno. Yes, ok. <coughs> On New Year's Day, parents make the children, yes, wake the children, uh, the children by tapping them on the head with their onion. Ok. Wake up. Wake up, yes, 
Yes, with the onion. ¿Sí? ¿Cómo lo, le despiertan a los chicos? Con una... Con una... Con un cebollazo en la cabeza. Me hace no le tiran fuerte, ¿bien? ¿sí? Pero le hacen así. Ok, wake up, wake up, wake up with the onion. Yes, ok. Por eso dice tapping them on the head with the onion. No la matan con un cebollazo. Yes. Ok, another tradition is that Greek families gather around and play cards. Yes, so they meet and play cards for long hours. They play games. Yes, uh, often start in the early evening and until midnight. Se juntan y hasta la medianoche están jugando qué? Cards. Yes, they share a moment. Juegan a las cartas, different board games. Yes, okay, because the activity is to meet. Yes, to get together. Yes, okay, is it clear? Well, uh, let's go to, a ver, nos queda la última, in Spain, a ver qué es tradición. Esto me encanta porque también, yo lo hice y no llegué con las campanadas. Okay. In Spain, it is a tradition to eat 12 grapes. ¿Qué son grapes? Uvas. One, two, three, four, five, until 12. Yes, to eat, but, esperen que todavía eso no es lo difícil. One at each stroke of the clock at midnight, ¿sí? Se pone el canal TVE, ¿sí? Que es un canal muy conocido y ellos dan, están todos los artistas y eso presentando las 12 campanadas, ¿yes? ¿Ok? So, por eso dice with the stroke of a clock. Entonces, ahora comienzan las campanadas, vos tenés que eh, preparar tu cava, ¿yes? ¿Ok? Or champagne, qué sé yo, pero en Spain se toma cava. Yes, okay. So you drink your cava. Es como una especie de sparkling wine. Yes, okay. Entonces, a cada campanada son 12 campanadas y ya dicen los periodistas, estos to topísimos actores que presentan las campanadas. Yes, dice, ready, steady, go. Pan, 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 pan. And you have to eat the 12 uh, grapes. Yes, con las 12 campanadas. Sí, cuando suena las 12, digamos, sí. Each grape represents, a ver, ¿qué representa cada uva? Each grape represents good luck, yes, for one month. ¿Cuántos meses tiene el año? 12. 12. Entonces, por eso son las 12 uvas que uno se come, yes. Ok, yo no pude hacerlo con la campanada porque quería hablar, me reía, ok. Bueno, okay. pero uno está feliz en esos días de nuevo, ok. But in, in Spain it's very cold in New Year, yes. Here... Yes, it, it is in summer, it's summer, but on the other side of the world, yes, it's winter. Yes, okay. So each grape represents good luck for one month of the coming year. In bigger cities like Madrid and Barcelona, people gather in the main square to eat the grapes, yes, together and pass around bottles of cava, yes, okay? And so, ¿Qué hacen en ciudades como, fíjate ahora este año, si tenés tiempo, mirá, poné la 1, la TVE, y fíjate las 12 campanadas, o googlealo. Está buenísimo porque en in Madrid and in Barcelona, they meet in squares, en la plaza principal, y ahí está todo armado, todo, que se lo oye, suenan las 12 campanadas, y vos estás con tus groups of friends, uh, your parents and everything, and you drink and you eat, yeah, because you have to... Yes, drink and eat the twelve. Bueno, eso fue todo, yes, con respecto a, a New Year. Ahora vamos a Workbook, yes, ok. Al día del libro, ok, is it clear? In Argentina, in Argentina, in Argentina, the Workbook, the World Book Day is celebrated, yes, on the 23rd, Yes, el 23, on the 23rd uh, of April. On this day, official meetings are held in public libraries where people can buy books, yes, and local writers read books and the children sit there. Is it clear? Yes, yes famosos, de escritores famosos se sientan y leen, they read and you can listen and then they give you, a, you buy the book and they give you the autograph. Yes, y te dan autografiado y todo, yeah? Ok, bueno, otra cosa, in Spain, yes, it's on the 23rd of April, restaurants in Bilbao, Spain, offer books, los restaurantes te ofrecen libros, yes, 
to any person that wants them. Another way to celebrate is by making a favorite recipe from the book. Yes, okay. Uh, bueno, y acá dice eh, Birds of Paradise, que es un libro muy interesante que está lleno de recetas preciosas. Y en México también, el, 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 se me escapó ahí, el 23 de abril, The World Read Day, is celebrated by making loud reading. Yes, no leen despacio, read out loud. Leen en voz alta, yes or no? Yes, from other countries. They read books from other countries. Te toca leer diferentes libros de otros países. Yes, students and professors at Colima University celebrate World, World Book Day by reading 12 continuous hours. ¿Por cuántas horas leen? 12. 12 horas leyendo. Wow, qué copado. Each reader must get up and read a minimum of three minutes. Cada reader, cada lector, se tiene que levantar y leer, por ejemplo, tres minutos. Después el siguiente y después el siguiente. Está bueno. If you like reading. Yes. Ok. Um, in Francia, in France, vamos aquí, the 23rd of April, on this day people celebrate it by encourage other people to read their book in public. Entonces, aquí le llevan a la gente, to encourage, lo que, los alientan a leerlo en solos, a lo mejor, o in public. In public. Ay, yo quiero hacer eso. Readers are encouraged to bring books to cafés. Basis, street, puedes llevar en todas partes, a café, en el autobús, yes, en las calles, en las plazas públicas, and share them y compartir con otras personas. Yes, is it clear? Bueno, vamos ahora a el día de la amistad. Yes, ok, bueno, Mafalda is here with Felipe, ¿quién más está? Susanita and... Felipe. Yes, and all the, the, the family there. In Argentina, the official date of World, World, of World Friendship Day is unique because it is celebrated on the 20th of July, el 20 de julio. Yes. ¿Qué hacen los grupos de amigos acá? They meet, where, donde? At restaurants, at cafes, yes. And you give a present to your friend, yes. Is it clear? You drink a café and you talk. Y también hay otra cosa. Other groups exchange gifts secretly. Yes? ¿Cómo se llama ese juego de intercambiar? Amigo invisible. Amigo invisible. Yes? Exchange gifts. Gifts son regalos. Yes? Secretly. And this is called amigo invisible. Yes? Okay? Well, vamos a otra parte. World Friendship Day is celebrated the 30th of July in Australia. ¿Qué hacen en Australia? A tradition in this country is to give yellow roses. You have to give a yellow rose to your friend. It's very nice. Qué cute, qué es super tierno eso. Look, yeah. And you have to give a yellow rose. A todos tus amigos le das una rosa amarilla. Más un bracelet, yes. A bracelet is also given on this day as a symbol of true friends. Quién no le ha dado o quién no ha recibido un Friendship a bracelet, yes? Yo okay. le regalé y me regalaron. Muy bien. You give and you were given. Yes, yes? a bracelet. Un, un friendship bracelet, yes? Me encanta. ¿Por qué? ¿Qué simboliza eso? Verdadera amistad. Y cuando nos peleamos decimos, ay, devolveme mi, mi bracelet. Yes? <laughs> It means true friendship, yes? Vamos rapidito al otro. In India, world friendship, ay, perdón. World Friendship Day is celebrated on the first Sunday of August. On this day, people spend time, spend time with friends and express love, exchange friendship day gifts like flowers, cards, bracelets. Yes, okay? Y nos hay también que intercambian que gifts, brazaletes, yes, okay? And in Japan, a ver qué hacen en Japón, yes? World Friendship Day is also celebrated the 30th of July. Vieron que son diferentes días. 30 de julio, 30 de julio. Yes? The most interesting thing that happens in this country is that Japanese celebrate their friendship with the USA. Oh, the bond between these countries is celebrated by the exchange of dolls as a special gift to celebrate the friendship. ¿Qué intercambia? Muñecas. Dolls. Ah, eso está divino también. ¿Ok? Well, es que esto es para cultura general, para saber lo que vamos a leer ahora y para ir viendo lo que hacen en otros países. Oh, Friendship Day, ¿qué más? Oh, Book 
today and on new, in New Year. Yes, okay, is it clear? Shall we go to the pages? Yes, page 128, we are going to listen. Are you ready? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Festivals, New Year, recording one. Listen and read. Hi, I'm Evelyn. I love New Year. Estas palabras que tienen negrita quiero que las subrayes con el highlighter. Is it clear? Tiene highlighter. Have you got a highlighter? Yes. Mientras que va diciendo la nena, la niña. Recording one. Listen and read. Hi, I'm Evelyn. I love New Year. The 31st of December is New Year's Eve. In the UK, we celebrate New Year's Eve with family and friends. We have a lot of delicious party food. At midnight, we sing a song together. We say, Happy New Year to everyone. Often, there are some fireworks outside. It's very exciting. January is New Year's Day. It's the first day of the new year. We make New Year's resolutions. Esto me encanta. Este año voy a hacerlo. New Year's resolutions. Miren al lado. Ride my bike. Be happy. Be happy. Be happy. Yes, okay. Do my homework. Do my homework. Love teacher Ruth. Love teacher Ruth. Yes, okay. Hace esa voz con él a mí también. Yes, practice piano every day. ¿Vieron qué lindas que son las resoluciones? Yes, okay. Is it clear? Good. A resolution is something you want to do in the new year. Here are my New Year's resolutions. My New Year's resolutions. Ride my bike to school twice a week. Mm -hmm. Eat fruit and vegetables every day. Mm. Do my homework. Or drink a lot of water. On Saturday. Help my parents at home through... Help my parents. Guang, guang. Three times a week. Practice the piano every day. Be nice to my friends. Hmm. Be nice with... Be nice to other people. Be nice to your parents. Be nice to your family. Yes? Okay? Is it clear? Bueno, en un papelito, ¿qué vas a hacer ahora? Vas a escribir cinco resoluciones. Ponemos aquí. My New Year Resolution y escribí cinco resoluciones. Rapidito. Ready, steady, go. Cinco resoluciones para el año. Empezando por la más importante. Yes. Uh, my New Year Resolution. Year's Resolutions. Ok. Estas son las mías, ¿eh? No me copies, ¿eh? Ok. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay. Um, Are you ready? I finished. Ok, you finished. Ok, number one. Be happy, que es la más importante porque si sos feliz de ahí vienen muchas cosas. Spend time with my family. Spend more time. Voy a poner más tiempo con mi familia. Play with my daughters. Do more exercises and read a book. Aldana, your resolution. Be happy, help my parents. Help my parents. In el two. Yes. Help my parents. Yes. Play with my sister. Do English homework. Do English homework and love mathematics. Ok? Esa ponemos. Love mathematics. Ok? Well, vamos a contestar aquí estas questions juntos. Are you ready? Yes? Las de abajo. Yes? 
Son lindas. Las resoluciones las vas a tener que pegar en tu cuadernito, ¿eh? ¿Ok? Good. Well, which is the first New Year's Eve uh, or New Year's Day? ¿Cuál es el primer día? Which is first? New Year's Eve o New Year's Day? New Year's, New Year's Eve. Eve. Yes, ¿por qué? ¿Qué quiere decir New Year's Eve? La... ¿Qué se dice? Víspera. La víspera, muy bien. New Year's Eve. Aquí estamos, yes. What do you say every, everyone at midnight? ¿Qué se dice cuando suena la campanada y que se dice? Happy, Happy New Year. Happy New Year, yes. Happy New Year. Number three. What happens outside at midnight? ¿Qué tiran? Fireworks. Fireworks, yes. And what is New Year's? Uh, what is a New Year resolution? ¿Qué significa una resolution? Is something. Is something. Está en el texto, eh? Is something you want, you want to do in the next. In the new year, yes? Okay, what is a resolution? Is something, está aquí, is something you want to do in the new year. Esa sería la respuesta cuatro. ¿Lo pusieron? Yes, okay, good. So now let's go to Friendship Day. Escuchamos el listening, the Friendship Day. Festivals, World Friendship Day. Recording one. Listen and read. Hi, I'm Matthew. I make a card for my best friend on World Friendship Day. People around the world celebrate World Friendship Day, usually in the summer. On World Friendship Day, we say thank you to our friends. We think about how they help us. We also think about how we can be a good friend. Children sometimes make cards for their friends. They write messages or poems inside the cards. Yes. Some children give a small gift to their friend, like a friendship bracelet or some chocolate. What do you do on World Friendship Day? Dear Sam, you're my best friend. Thank you for everything you do for me. Matthew. Dear Mary, I like you more than a cupcake. I like you more than a cup of tea. I like you more than a box of chocolates. Aww. Because you're my friend, you see. Ah, it's very beautiful. I love cards. I really like love cards. Yes, um, bueno, en Inglaterra venden unas cards que son así de grandes. And they are very beautiful. Uh, it is a tradition to give cards, yes, to your family or to your friends. Y son muy divinas. Y mira qué lindo esto, ¿sí? Entonces, they exchange bracelets, they give cards, and they write beautiful messages on the cards. Yes, porque a veces una, una card, yes, mm, un, una de estas cards, yes, una tarjeta, es más importante que un regalo, ¿sí? Porque lo puedes poner en un marquito, te queda para siempre, yes. Bueno, un regalo también puede ser, but this is from, directly from your heart, yes. I like you more than a cake, I like you more than a cup of tea, uh, I like you more than a box of chocolate, because you are my friend, you see, it's very beautiful. It's very beautiful. Fun fact. Some animals have friends too. Monkeys, elephants and dolphins all have friendships within their group or family. Did you know, sabías eso? Que los animales, animals have friends between their families and between the, the, their group. Yes, they, they have a... A kind of friendship. I didn't know that. Okay? Bueno, vamos al verdadero o falso. Verdadero o falso. Yes? Are you ready? Yes? Okay. Good. Vamos a hacerlo juntos. Yes? Como un quiz show. Okay? Good. Well, where, uh, World Friendship Day is usually in winter. Yes? True or false? Yes? False. It is usually in summer. Ahí 
It's in summer, but here in Argentina and this uh, part of the world is in winter. Yes, okay. Number two, we say that we say we, we say thank you to our pets on on Friendship Day. False. We say thank you to our friends on, on Friendship Day. Yes. Is it clear? Good. Um. Well. Uh, what else? We sometimes number three give make cards on World World Friendship Day. Yes, this is true. Yes, and we give gifts to our friends on World Friendship Day. This is true. Si queramos regalos, marca la palabra cards, messages, poems, gift, and bracelets. Yes, okay. Todo con el resaltador. Yes, give. Bueno, todas las palabras salían, pero por ahí si no sabes. Bueno, gift es un regalo. Yes, okay. Good. Wait a minute. Please, wait. Good. Well, ¿qué vas a hacer ahora? En otro pedacito de papel, como hiciste recién, vas a escribir una card, una carta. Así como esta que hicimos, pero vas a hacer... Vas a escribir, you are going to write a card. Cortita nomás, ¿eh? ¿Qué sería para tu amigo? ¿Mm? Happy, happy day, my dear friend. Hacela con un pedazo de cartulina o algo así. Un heart. I love you. More than más que qué, yes, okay. I love you more than a qué, than a piece of cake, <laughs> a piece of pizza, yes, okay. Y seguimos escribiendo. You are very nice. I like you more. I love you more than a cup of Yes, I love you more than an ice cream. Y vas a firmar abajo. Yes, your friend Ruth. Ok. Is it clear? Una carta bien cortita pero linda. Y lo pegas, tenemos dos cosas ya que pegamos. Uh, nuestras resolutions for the new year and a card for a friend. Yes, ok. Okay, so let's go very quickly now to the other page. Workbook day. Yes, todas estas palabras que salen, for example, character, parade, assembly, quiero que estén subrayadas. Are you ready? Esta sería la, el último reading de aquí. Festivals. World Book Day. Recording one. Listen and read. My name's Emily. World Book Day is my favourite day at school. World Book Day is in March every year in the UK and it's the best day of the school year. We all dress up as characters from our favourite books. Okay, they está divino. I really like this day because they dress up. They dress up. ¿Qué significa dress up? Que practicamos la clase pasada. Teacher Ruth dressed up, dressed up last class, yes? Disfrazarse, pero de qué se disfrazan, yes? They dress up as characters from favorite books, yes? Characters, los personajes de sus favorite books, yes? Tom Sawyer, what else? Ah, Caperucita Roja, ¿quién más? Sherlock Holmes, yes? Okay, Little Red Riding Hood, Little Red Riding Hood, yes? My little sister, yes, okay. Favorite books, yes, okay. Qué bueno que está, yes, okay. Well, um, yes, I really like it. Today I'm dressing up as Wally from Where's Wally? Where's Wally? Yes, I like this book. 
and my best friend Oliver is dressing up as Willy Wonka. No, it, it, it wasn't Sherlock Holmes, it was Willy Wonka, yes? This is very, 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 very nice, yes? Did you see the film? Did you read the book? From Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Yes, okay. My little sister, Betsy, is Little Red Riding Hood. Oh. There's a parade around the school. Okay, and then when all the students dress up, yes, um, from their favorite books, yes, okay, and there is a parade. Que es un parade? Un desfile. And imagine the children are very, very happy. But not only the children. For example, if your, your, first, uh, your favorite book is Harry Potter, yes, you can dress up as Harry Potter, Hermione, yes, and it's very nice. We walk around the school and then there's a special assembly in the school hall. Our parents watch the assembly. We all show our books and talk about our characters. It's an amazing day. Yes, okay. And there is an assembly, parents listen and all the children speak about the, the character. Hello, I'm uh, Willy Wonka. Yes, I really ba 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 ba. Hello, I am Little Red Riding Hood, Little Red Riding Hood, Caperucita Roja. Um, I have to take some food to my grandmother, but when I go there, yes, when I went there, I went to, to, to give, I went to give my, um, I went to take my grandmother uh, some food because she was sick. When I went into the woods, yes, into the hoods, yes, there was a very, 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 very awful person, animal, yes, okay, and it was the wolf, yes. When I arrived home, yes, my grandmother's home, there was, uh, she was different, yes. She, uh, she had big eyes, she has a big mouth, and she wanted to eat me. She was a wolf, and she ate, yes, my grandmother, but, Yes, somebody helped us. Yes, entonces imagínate todo el mundo hablando, haciendo un role play de su personaje especial. Será divino. Yes. Okay. Well, so we're going to choose and write the correct words for, to complete the summary. Okay. Are you ready? Lo hacemos juntos. Dale. Um, world. Esto es para buscar siempre cuando trabajamos con un reading buscamos la información en el texto. World Day, World Book Day in the UK, en el, en el Reino Unido, is in, buscamos rapidito en qué mes, a ver, tu, 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 ya lo encontré, March. Children dress up as their favorite book, ¿cómo se dice personajes? Escribió la teacher aquí, characters, yes. Number two, characters. This year, Emily is dressing up as, ¿cómo quién se vistió? Wally. Emily's little sister is dressing up as, Little Red Riding Hood. Little Red Riding Hood. Yes, como Robin Hood, Hood. Por la capa. Yes, okay. The children, ah, perdón. There is a, number five, there is a parade. Yes, un desfile around the school. Then there is a special assembly. The children show their, what? Their books, muestran sus libros, and talk about their characters. And that is so. Yes? Okay. Well, so, I hope this class, espero que te haya gustado esta clase, porque fue un poquitito de, de cultura, general culture, yes, about Friendship Day, about New Year, cómo lo festejan en los different countries, yes, about the World Day, and que tenemos tres páginas de tarea, 120, 120, 121, and 122. Te das cuenta que el libro está terminado, yes? Pero ahora vamos a informar cómo sigue la segunda parte del año, la, la próxima parte, pero todavía nos queda parte del activity book. ¿Está? ¿Ok? Bueno. Well, um, 120. Exercise 1. Find circle the words. Si no te acordás, acordate que tenés que recurrir al texto que leímos. Find the hidden message y después te va a salir un mensaje escondido, como siempre, cuando lo completas. And then write your New Year's resolution. Y escribir las resoluciones, puedes copiar las mismas que hiciste o agregar otras más. 
¿Sí? Yes, las que hicimos en clase, las que tenemos ahí. Esas son mis resoluciones. Yes, ok. Is it clear? Good. World Friendship Day. Otra vez complete the puzzle para trabajar con el vocabulario. Y es que nos damos, nos damos un GIF, un bracelet, cards. We write a message on a card. We make a card. Yes, on a letter. Draw a picture. Y también hacer un poema al lado. Yes, I love you more than, yes. No, vayan a poner I hate more than a cake. Yes, ok. Que tenga rima eso, a ver si sale algo, ¿eh? Ok, después World Book Day. Yes, ok. Unimos, parade, character, assembly. Yes, ok. Vamos al libro. Otra vez escribimos los nombres de los characters que aparecieron. Willy Wonka. Yes, Little Red Riding Hood. ¿Y quién más aparecía? Me falta uno, 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 uno. Yes, ok. I like. Y vas a dibujar. El, la cover, la tapa de tu libro, y vas a poner por qué te, te gusta ese libro. Yes? I like Harry Potter because it's very, very interesting. Yes? Okay? And that's all. Well, so, um, this is all. Yes, I hope, espero que te haya gustado esta clase. Yes? Okay? I say bye-bye, see you next class, and happy weekend. Bye-bye, third grade. Yes, okay, bye-bye, happy weekend.